Hey! Ah, what rotten timing. Just as you drop by, I have to head out for business. There's this restaurant I frequent. The geisha there have been having some trouble lately. One has to lend a helping hand when one can, you know? It's all about Ejiri, so a bit of a trek, but you want to come too? Ha! I thought you were looking bored. Well then, by all means, let's be off. As soon as the gang leaders disappeared, they were replaced by corrupt officials. Picking fights at post stations, harassing geishas, things really have gotten out of control. Mr. Takazuki, thank you for coming. Just a moment while I prepare refreshments. Don't waste your time. Those officials, they still giving you trouble? Yes. They came again last night, made a mess of the place, then left without paying. They're running the business into the ground. <sighs> and they presume to run the country. And what of the man I sent ahead? Ito? He's gone to investigate the officials in question. Please. You must help us. There's no one else we can turn to. I will do what I can, but it will likely be just this once. I don't exactly have a lot of free time, I'm afraid. Having heard the dilemma? You'll help too, then. First off, let's meet up with Ito. You don't remember? He attacked the British legation with us. I'm sure you'll recognize him. Come on, let's go. Mr. Takasugi doesn't quite seem himself. I do hope he's all right. We, all of us here, are very fond of him. You take good care of him for us, won't you? I hope that fool, Ito, hasn't made a mistake.
Kasuki, you had me worried. Oh, you came too. How encouraging. Those nasty officials are at their base. All we have to do is storm it. Let's go. Let me come with you. All done. Let's hurry over to their base. Right, that takes care of that. I'm a bit tired. I would head on back to the restaurant. Hey, wait. You can't just go by yourself. I'm coming too. For Master Takazuki, he's already here, and by the sound of the samisen, I'd say he's in quite a good mood. Although it might not seem like it. Takasugi really does trust you. Look out for him, will you?
Good work back there. Everything went smoothly, thanks to you. But these corrupt officials are as common as rats. We would run ourselves ragged if we tried to deal with each and every one of them. No. With their protection fees, I'd say the gangs were just as bad. The officials just took over with their own brand of villainy. In any case, it's always the common folk who suffer. Still, they are not completely powerless. This incident should have shown the people of Ejiri that they don't need to fear the authorities. Same for those in Chinatown. By uniting under a common purpose, they can strike back at their oppressors. Now more than ever, I see the truth in Master Showing words. If he were to overthrow the Shogunate and save Japan, the masses must... <coughs> There's no fooling you, is there? <laughs> I'm sorry you had to see that. I'm all fine now, so don't worry. <clears throat> Just keep this between us, all right? Hello there. Everyone still had a bit of a loss after what happened with Genzui. Now we're allied with the Satsuma. The time is ripe. I need to pull myself together. Speaking of the Satsuma, one of their men demanded a duel some time ago. It was quite a while back. Do you remember? I'm embarrassed. That means a lot coming from you. Katsura, there's just no way we can ascend to this. You want us to join forces with those who drove Kusaka to his death? I assure you, it pains me too. I didn't expect you to come around to the idea just like that. Which is why I've prepared the banquet for us with the Satsuma. On their end, Okubo will take the lead. Kuroda's lot will be attending too. It'll be a good chance to see if they're worthy of our trust. Don't you think? Very well then. I shall take the measure of the Satsuma and decide for myself. If possible, I'd like you to attend as well. What do you say? Good. I've made arrangements at the place nearby. Come by later. Right, let's go. Oh, Kubo of the Satsuma is running late, it seems. However, I did see the man who sent me that letter. This is a hot blooded gathering. <laughs> It'll be interesting to see how this unfolds. Sorry for the wait. Let's begin, shall we? Katsura, remember that jewel we had? I have to say, I was rather disappointed at the time. You had no clue who I was, but let me go free. Too soft for a samurai. 
And now we are to stand shoulder to shoulder. We, Satsuma, despair. You're a fool! Katsura sees further into the future than either of us. If he let you go free, he had a good reason! You are a bold one. I sense you are a far more formidable foe than Katsura, at least. You there. Yamagata, was it? If you dislike what we have to say, come and silence us with your fists. Perhaps then I'll reconsider. I'd be only too delighted. I don't need a weapon to take down the likes of you. You'll soon regret. Disrespecting Katsura and the Choshu. Hey, cut it out! Uh, I don't think there's any stopping this now. I swear if Okubo has my head for this. Don't worry. Just let them have at it. Kusaka Katsura! The brave of people of Choshu! One wrong move is all it takes for a force to come down. You should know for us. You're so strong. When you're supposed to be a coward. I don't think in a circle. How can I expect anyone to follow me? You were all talk, but you're not bad. I, too, underestimated your strength. Katsura, I ask you, forgive my rudeness just now. <laughs> Sobering up, are we? I'm glad you put on this feast. It was worth it just to see that tussle. Overthrowing the Shogun, it won't be the end of it. We'll need good, reasonable men like Katsura here to right the course of our nation. Thank you, everyone. Now, let's get back to enjoying the feast. My apologies for dragging you along to this. But I have to say, seeing you fight never fails to impress. In fact, that particular display made me want to try my luck. Why not go around with me? I'll be waiting out back for you. Right, let's begin. I like to think I know your abilities better than anyone. That's to say, I won't hold back. That's rather impressive, you know. Nakamura said that I'm too strong, and I am. This I have full well. <laughs> I'm starting to warm up. Hit me! Who's that guy? 
Nakamura. And I see Okubo has finally arrived. Hmm. I see from that jewel you aren't as soft as I thought. Your resolve is clear for all to see. Did you plan this little display from the start? Of course not. I just fancied brushing up on my sword play. I'm delighted you enjoyed what you saw, regardless. A likely story. <laughs> well, as your partner in this alliance, I liked what I saw. I warn you, I intend to rely on your sword arm. <sighs> I can't believe Okubo and the others were watching. Thanks to that unexpected audience, it seems the Alliance will hold a little longer. The Knights worked out beautifully, thanks to you. Though it was hard to ignore Nakamura's provocations at first. Honestly, I have my own doubts about whether doing things my way will really be able to change Japan. I do have a vision, and everyone's been good enough to follow me. But. Behind closed doors, I worry all the time. What's your opinion? Am I doing things the right way? Thank you. If that's what you think, I have nothing to fear. <laughs> 